वेलकम डियर स्टूडेंट्स टूडे विल सी द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ प्रोग्राम्स फॉर एडिशन ऑफ टू नंबर्स सो दिस इज द आउटलाइन ऑफ एनी प्रोग्राम टूडे विल डू द प्रोग्राम इन मोबाइल ऐप यू कैन इंस्टॉल एनी सी कंपाइलर सी कोडिंग ऐप सो फर्स्ट लाइन इज ऑलवेज हैश इंक्लूड एस टी डी आई ओ डॉट एच यू कैन गिव द कमेंट एट द टॉप ऑफ द प्रोग्राम फॉर specifying the name of the program or you can give the author name date of the program so i am typing here the comment as program for addition so slash star write down the text and then close with the star slash then continue a program so comments are not executable statements so we want to declare two variables so in the last lecture we are seeing the different data types so we are taking the integer variables a and b a and b we are doing the addition of a and b a plus b now just simply assign the values to the variables so a equal to 10 in the first program we will initialize the variables we are not taking the input from user so in the program itself we are initializing the values you can give any number a equal to 10 b equal to 2 and now you have to calculate the addition or sum so declare one more variable at the top sum all the variables should be declared at the top of the program sum equal to a plus b every statement in c should be followed with the semicolon so end hona chahiye semicolon se except for loop while loop so loops when we learn the loops will not include the semicolons at the end now print the sum addition of two numbers print f the sum equal to percent d comma sum so this printf function will give some text percent d is the format specifier to print the integer values so percent d ke jagah pe addition place ho jayegi it will replace the sum now run you can see 10 plus 2 is 12 so likewise you can assign the any numbers to a and b and the addition will be calculated the sum will be calculated so this is the just simple program same program you can repeat for subtraction so a minus b you can calculate the subtraction a into b you can calculate the multiplication another way to give the comment is double slash line so double slash and you can see take input from user this is the comment now we'll see how to take the input from user to so print f and scan f statements are required to take the input from user to so a equal to 10 instead of a equal to 10 we'll use scan f so first in print f we'll write the message symbol enter a number in the second next line we'll do the scan f to take the input from the user so we'll take two numbers number 1 and number 2 in a and b from the user so observe how i am taking the inputs scan f bracket so use percent d as it is a integer data type you can use the you can do the addition of decimal points also so in that case you have to declare float a comma b and instead of percent you have to use percent f now to take input you have to use scan f percent d comma ampersand a so ampersand is indicating the address of variable a so when you take the input it is saved at the vari variable a similarly take the input for the number b from the user so scan f percent d 
comma ampersand a so person d should be in the double quotes followed by semicolon and then ampersand b name of the variable so what i have missed semicolon at the end of scanf so you can see the error comma ampersand b give the semicolon at the end So try to read out the errors and remove those errors. <clears throat> Human errors can happen. So don't worry if you have the error. Give the semicolon at the end. Run. Enter a number. So give a number for addition. Again run, it's not properly given the input, run, <coughs> enter a number, <coughs> 1, enter another number, 2, 1 plus 2, 3, so likewise you can execute it again and see how the output will appear. Enter another number 22 and 11. So the addition is 33. So this is how you can do the addition of two numbers. So you can add three numbers as well. So addition of three numbers. So what you have to do? Now we have two variables a, b, third one is c. Now instead of a plus b, you can write a plus b plus c. Two inputs liye humne a and b ke liye. Third input bhi lena hoga. Enter a number 3 and take ampersand c. So likewise you can add any number Now we'll do taking the input in a single scanf statement. So enter two numbers. Two separate line pe humne input liya tha. Now we'll take on a single line. So percent t, percent d, two times likna hai kyunki hum do percent d, percent d, two times and we have to write down two variables. Ampersand a, ampersand b. So separate with the comma. In percent D, percent D, no need to give the comma. So we can write percent D, percent D, and percent A, and percent B. So it will ask for the entering two numbers at the same time. Say if you are doing on the computer, cut these statements. Okay, now the program is ready. Compile it, execute, run, enter two numbers, give the input. Now you have to enter two numbers at the same time. Five, five, five plus five, ten. So sum equal to ten. Again, execute, enter two numbers, ten. Hundred plus two hundred, three hundred is the sum. So, likewise, you can perform the different addition program. Thank you.